Hey y'all and welcome to my channel. My name is Bridget and I own Glow and Go Aesthetics. Today we're going to be doing something extra fun. We're going to be taking a look at some of the beauty industry's best videos that are out there right now on the internet. So I love being a part of the beauty industry. There are so many facets to it, right? You have people who do permanent makeup, you have people who do nails, pedicures, people who do hair. Um, there's just so many things, right? We do waxing, we do lashes, there's like a plethora the scope of practice is ginormous and this industry is amazing. And here are some of my favorite videos that I have found within the beauty industry. I'm just having fun over on TikTok and Instagram. I just, I mean, I literally love watching these videos and I hope you like them too. Let's take a look. Okay, so this first one is from Instagram. Look, this girl is in Russian. I can't be held accountable for how to say it, but it's lash underscore J Y L I A. And this, I look, I personally do not do lash lifts, but I do love watching videos on them and seeing them. It's just not my favorite service to provide, but let's take a look at her video. She does an amazing job. First of all, yes, look at that. Girl, that looks moisturized. <laughs> that looks so beautiful. She did an amazing job. But like, what is that stuff that she's actually using? Like, did she make those? Because I ain't never seen, I, I've never seen supplies like that. That looks homemade. Love that for you. Okay, this next video has been going around the internet for a couple of weeks and it's hilarious i've seen it on all my different accounts actually youtube instagram tiktok so it's viral viral love this cracks me up okay. let me take a look okay. holy yeah, so crack -a moly let me see the other one. Oh lord no problem it's fixable i got you okay you want this special treatment um, she's like, do I need it? <laughs> oh, what's special? Um, I got you, boo. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Yep, take your time. Um, so the special treatment, is it included? All for you, for you today. <laughs> oh, cool. Because of your toe, you qualify I for qualify. the free treatment. Oh. Yeah. And it's included. Oh, All hell right. yeah, for these kind of toes? Definitely. Stop. I know they're pretty neglected. No, they're not bad. They just, they pass for a free treatment. What the hell? I've never had. You never had, you never had this? No. This is our ritual. It's where, you know, sometimes because you have bad feet, the spirit <laughs> is, is concentrated here. So we got to get the spirit out so that at least your feet is going to feel free and relieved doing an exorcism trust me i've been doing this for a year girl um holy thank you you're welcome oh my gosh okay obviously that was probably fake but it's hilarious nonetheless i mean sometimes as a beauty provider we see things that we are like wow yeah, that needs some work. But we're never disgusted because literally it's our job. You know, like we don't have a reason to be like really disgusted with stuff. But sometimes, yeah, we look at something and we're like, yeah, I know why you're here. I, 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 I get it. This next video is probably one of my favorite videos that is out there right now. And you're gonna see why in just a second. Get that glue on there, girl. That's kind of satisfying to see that. Look at stop! Look at him! Look how confident he looks. Okay, that's a grip test right there, girl. Ain't getting snatched up. That looks so good. I love that video because it shows you that like. Women are not the only ones who can benefit from all these beauty services that are offered. 
cosmetologists, estheticians, like we offer services to all different types of people. And I just love that he is so confident after you can see it on his face. He is literally like lighting up and it looks so good. I really like the texture of that hair. It was legit looks like he, when he gets that wet, that's he could be like whoosh, little mermaid status. That looks so good. And it's the point that like as a half black woman, I know that within my community, there are so many of us who will choose to wear a wig. Um, I have personally not worn one in a long time since my hair was really short, but like I get wanting to wear one because you just, you wanna look your best or feel your best, you know? And the same thing can be said for a man. Like we aren't the only ones who have feelings. Boys have feelings too. Like they legit have feelings. <laughs> But she did such an amazing job making him feel like confident. You, I mean, you could just see it in his face. I love that for him. The homegirl turn off the comments. I don't know how long ago that video was taken, but she turned off the comments, unfortunately. I bet you there were women tearing him up on there. I don't know why. Like, everybody deserves to feel and look beautiful. And if anyone, because you know what? The first time I saw this video, actually the comments were on. So she just recently turned them off, which means people was acting up in there, which is not cool. But like, it's not catfishing. Uh, women do it all the time. We get our lashes done. We wear wigs. Uh, we get facials. Like we do the whole, the whole thing. We get brow laminations. Like we, we literally shape shift all the time. And I feel like as long as he, his partner knows, like, and she is happy that he feels confident, I don't see a problem with it at all. This right here, he is one of my favorite estheticians, if not my favorite, honestly, because the quality of his work literally just speaks for itself. It's amazing. What, what you got for us? When you're washing your face, does it feel like you're running your fingertips over 30 grit sandpaper? Seriously, like you could literally rub your fingerprints right off of your fingers. Do you see the texture on my client's skin? She thought this was normal. She didn't think there was a way to get this off and she absolutely hated it. I said, no, when you're washing your face, it shouldn't feel like you're rubbing your fingers across a cheese grater. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. the first step was to remove all of that texture, which you see I've done here. I did this by hand. I didn't use any acids, no salicylic, no mandelic, really no glycolic. Amazing. I removed all that texture off of her face by hand. And then we buffed her skin out. But do you see after I buffed it out, it looks like I used mm -hmm. one of those nail buffers that they have at the nail shop. See how dry her Look skin how is? And to do this, I only use my Emu Serum soap and some rose water. Her microdermabrasion filter looked like we have vacuumed the carpet. But by the end, she got her hard reset. Gay yes. Ronnie is like the goat with some congested skin. Man, he will, he'll make you look beautiful. I love that he's telling people like this isn't normal to have this. Like we can help you because you don't know what's not normal unless you honestly come across a video that's like telling you or your esthetician is honest with you like you don't ever know and I just love that he's kind of like telling people flat out like if you feel like that that's not normal but we can do something about it like you don't have to live with it I just he is my guy this man Ronnie he's the esthetician baby if you've been with me for any length of time you've probably noticed I kind of like anime like I've had it on my shoes, I talk about it sometimes. And this next video, like I wanna ask one of my SD besties from school if she could do this to me because I legit like this look and I love this, I don't know, I, ju I just like fun, right? Take a look at this video. <laughs> Oh, 
love the creativity of our community. Like you saw that bald headed guy, he got a wig. He, well, it's not really a wig. I mean, it's a piece, whatever. And we got the anime lash set looking beautiful. We got beautiful artists who, I mean, being a esthetician, cosmetologist, there is a definite, definite sense of like artistry yeah! that comes with it where we're create creatives, you know, we're literally like tapping into that side of our brain to make you feel beautiful too. And I just, I literally love our community. Thank you so much for watching this video today. I hope you enjoyed some of my favorite beauty industry videos. I just, I can't get enough of our community. I just love us. If you haven't already, go ahead and like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one, queen.